Summer is winding down for the Shulman family. And with two children with food allergies, that means getting ready to go back to school now. Before school starts, um, I always make sure to get in touch with my child's teacher, um, with the school nurse. The American College of Asthma, Allergy and Immunology says from kindergarten to college, being prepared is critical. And for elementary students, parents need to be an advocate for children. Speaking to the teachers, the administration, um, also you can do small measures like having the child bring a placemat to eat their food on, discussing the importance of hand hygiene. Allergist Dr. Alyssa Hirsch says middle and high school students need to learn to watch out for themselves. The highest incidence of accidental exposures happen in those teenage years and they can have worse outcomes because they don't always carry their EpiPens. Children with allergies or asthma should have emergency action plans like these as well as their EpiPen twin pack at school. This is my go bag. The Shulmans know how important it is to be ready. Eight-year-old Oliver is allergic to sesame. Three-year-old Davis just had an anaphylactic reaction to nuts for which their mom used the EpiPen and called 911. Because we had this experience so recently, I also just regained like a sense of vigilance. I read the labels all the time. Oliver also makes sure his friends and teachers know about his allergies. So if they don't know, I always tell them. Because having everyone at school on the same page could be life-saving. Kenneth Craig, CBS News, Woodmere, New York.